The scene in the lagoon behind Sanibel Drive in the Ortega area January 3rd may have looked like a fishing trip, but it was a humane hunting expedition to capture a juvenile manatee suffering from the icy cold weather. And after three hours, state biologists finally corralled the sick mammal. The, the water that he was in was pretty deep. And our net only goes down to 30 feet, but it actually can really only catch a manatee in about 20 feet of water. So getting him in the right location and, um, was difficult. Yes. Hauled aboard a Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission boat via net, Garrett throttled up and left the lagoon, headed into the Ortega River and the Wayne B. Stevens boat ramp nearby. That's where more staff and a van awaited the sick manatee. Neighbors who live on Sanibel Drive had spotted the manatee in the water off their dock earlier in the day and called the state to get help. You guys did a good job. It's always a little bit of luck. It's a little bit of uh, predicting. We, we turned the engine off and kind of snuck into a little corner, which worked out really well for us. It was a little bit shallower over there, and he kind of stuck his nose up, and we, we went for it. The crew carefully unwraps the manatee, which is tied up in a lot of nets after a long, long capture, getting it down to one layer of nets before they transfer off the manatee research boat of the Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission. The crew that rescued the mammal says it's showing signs of cold weather exposure, but otherwise seems okay. It is a female, and she's a little underweight. Her belly's kind of wrinkled, uh, showing signs that, that she probably hasn't eaten in a while. The edges of her um, tail are showing signs of a cold stress. It took a few minutes to untangle the net from the manatee, its back scarred with at least one gouge mark, probably from a boat propeller. Then the crew slid a sling under the large gray mammal, its tail fin chewed up and pockmarked. Eight humans lifted one sick marine mammal up, then onto a state van. One, two, three, up. Okay, hold up, people in. One, two, three. Good, good, good. good. The manatee was shipped to SeaWorld in Orlando for observation and treatment. It stays in the cold waters of the Ortega River and Lagoon quite evident on its gray hulk. And it's, it's very thin underneath, the, the belly's buckled in, so um, it's probably just safer than stars to get them to take a look at it. Well, and I'm Steve. I Steve, how you doing? Well, thanks again for keeping yeah. track of this. Oh, glad you got it. For My West Side Son, I'm Dan Scanlon.